Survivor is getting a great holiday gift this year from a complete stranger. Medical reporter Liz Bonas shares how a special delivery just in time for Christmas could save a life. Hey there, everybody. Eight years ago, Matthew Weaver signed up to be the match when he was just starting his pharmacy education. And then just weeks ago, he got the call. This call is for Matthew Weaver. My name is Fred from Be the Match Registry. You're now listening to that call. It turned out Matthew was a perfect match for a person with blood cancer who needed his stem cells to survive. My first thought is there's no way I'm going to be able to do this. He thought that because he's in his busiest time ever as a pharmacy resident at Ohio's University of Cincinnati. But that was before Nicola Harder-Dykes, his pharmacy residency program director, told him. Please do it. We'll give you all the resources you need. This is a great opportunity. And so just days ago, Matthew got hooked up to a machine like this one at UC Health. The team here, one of just a handful of sites in the country that takes stem cell donations. It just happened to be on the campus of Matthew's own university. Donation specialist Dr. Carolyn Alquist told me when it comes to stem cell matching. The odds of being picked are slim, for sure. But Matthew's stem cells are now on their way to giving someone else the gift of life. Those stem cells are like little heat-seeking missiles. They will go to the bone marrow and they will start producing all the healthy cells that that patient needs. His donor team won't know how well his donation works for a while, but I had to ask. How do you feel about perhaps at the holidays completely giving a gift that changes a life? I, I think that's the greatest gift that I could get this Christmas and hopefully is a gift to their family to be able to see their loved one, you know, a little bit longer. Now, Be The Match does tend to focus on recruiting younger donors. They do tend to provide a high transplant success rate. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonas. Now back to you.